It's the most wonderful time of the year, and that can only mean one thing around here. Mike Strobel, former legend. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Who, who loves to sing. He's also come back to tell us all about the launch of the Sun's Christmas Fund for Variety Village. Mike, welcome back into the newsroom. Tell us what Did you the... say legendary? Doesn't that mean dead? <laughs> Not, not yet, not as far as we know. I am taller than you right now, so I'm going to take advantage of that. Um, yeah, I'm growing, Jay. Give us the background on the fund. Well, it's uh, you have to you have to kind of go to Variety Village to kind of get the feel for what the place is like. But it's a it's a sports complex in uh, Scarborough that's geared to it's geared to kids with disability, but it's for everybody, even uh, even an old fart. Uh, Retired newspaper man. I mean, I'm I'm a member out there, and and uh, I kind of get along with everybody. I, I could be swim, swimming in the pool with, you know, in, in one lane, and then there's a, a a blind kid in the next lane, and somebody with no legs in the next lane, and somebody kind of talking to the ceiling in the in the next lane, and nobody cares. It's just everybody kind of getting along and splashing around in the same pool, like quite literally. And um, and I've been raising money for our, through the Sun the Sun Christmas Fund for. Uh, about 12 years, took over from George Gross, George who, Gross? who really was yeah. and is a legend. <laughs> yes, he is. Um, and uh, between the two of us, we've raised something like a million and a half Fantastic. dollars, which is not bad. Not bad at all. And, and so who does it benefit? Some of the people you were just talking about? All of them. The kids. Yeah. You know, it's, it's uh, as I say, everybody's, everybody's welcome, but it's mainly geared to kids with disability. And, mm -hmm. and, uh, and it's kind of their home. For, for a lot of them, it's their home away from home. It's one of the few places, really, that... They kind of feel like they can be who they are and and, uh, and do what they want to do, and, and nobody really cares. Nobody you know stares at them or any of that kind of thing. And um, you know that's this you know it's kind of run on a bit of a shoestring budget, mm -hmm. I guess. Mm -hmm. And this money, uh, the money that Sun Readers have uh, provided, is uh, is really appreciated out there. Let me tell you. And do you find like is it tougher to get people to donate? There's so many kind of worthy causes, GoFundMe pages, or is it? I mean, this is the most worthy though, Jay. That's that's the key. <laughs> Okay. All right. And seriously, if you, you know, you go out there and take and walk walk around that place, and you'll be you'll be reaching for your wallet. Seriously. Mm -hmm. And how do people donate? That's the most important thing. Uh, SuddenChristmasFund.ca. Uh, the campaign starts uh, this week, and watch for my columns. I'll be I'll be highlighting some of the kids who who dwell out there and um, and uh, telling their stories, and and there'll be forums and all that kind of stuff, and and uh, it runs through until. New Year's. New Year's, fantastic. Well, f um, let us know what you think on Twitter and Facebook, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel.